Welcome, Welcome back, back to, to the basement, basement the, the friendliest, friendliest place. place on YouTube. We're back with a little bit more basement let's play recording after a uh, quite a hiatus. Yes, it's been a little while recording. We only missed like a week of uploads. Uh, now, Ted, is Tunic coming back? Yes, of course, Tunic is coming okay, back. Okay, good. I want everyone to know. Okay, let's go through here. Tunic is definitely coming back. We've got two music notes left to do in the messenger. Oh yeah, let's drop off our newest stuff. one here. Apparently, yeah. Drop this one off. What do we do by talking? What, what should I do? Hem. Through the. <laughs> well, sorry. I Thanks. Trying to find which button skip. It's fine. We can skip it. The no, dialogue I'll, is. I'll talk to him. No, again. You, you won't. Yeah, I will. As fate would beautifully have it, only by creating a melody from the crystallized forces of this world can the curse be broken. To complete the melody, we still need two music notes. <laughs> Note. Why would they do that that way? Can't they just dynamically change it from I'm note sure to note? I'm sure they did that to be funny. <laughs> Everything in this game is so funny. Through the healing hand of nature, a fallen messenger shall be redeemed. Well, what does that mean? I don't know. Talk to him again. Talk to get. Talk to him again. Is he going to say something different? He different stuff sometimes, yeah. Okay. Healing hand of nature. A fallen messenger shall be redeemed. Well, All Peter, right. What, what do you think that means? Um... It means to go in this one. Okay. No, why don't you tell me exactly what it means? Uh, Ted is uh, our helpful helper in the messenger. Everyone's tired of us wandering around fruitlessly. Whoops. I just went through a, a portal by accident. Fruitlessly? I was using the D-pad. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe this is the right spot, though. We want to go to the dark cave. Uh, okay. Where you need the true sight. Revere Turquoise, the fallen monk. Through the healing hand of nature, a fallen messenger shall be redeemed. Uh, wasn't there somewhere where we could, like, get money? That's right. We got a candle from the dude. And if that's the case, this can't we... This was a long we... time ago. Talk to the messenger and like pay him for a tip. What's this? I don't know what this is. Hey, it's you. I really miss the time where is the thing. Oh, there's no way to do it anymore. Welcome to the Tower of Time. I put it back as that course for beat the challenge, which I designed myself, by the way. <laughs> if you want to replay it, let me know. You may have missed a few hidden things. No. 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 Game has enough replay value, quote unquote. Okay, so we did the dark cave through the catacombs. <coughs> Anything? I'm having trouble understanding the prophecy. Maybe I can help. What did the prophet say? <coughs> <coughs> through the healing hand of nature, a fallen messenger shall be redeemed. Okay, oh, you believe this guy for 300 time shards? Uh, okay. Okay, look. Here in the Quill Shroom Marsh. Ugh. Oh, okay. Yes. Let's just do that. Talk to the guy and let's follow the 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 hints. Yeah. That's better so than that's go better than any walkthrough here. That is based on text only, Peter. Thanks for that uh, link. Hey, idea. just because you can't like, read. Like, hey, check out this link. Okay, so like, which one of go our going to the next room? Now which, go into the next room. Which one of our portals okay. goes to that spot on the map? That's what I need to know. Um that's a good question. Yeah, I don't Let's know go look at them and see. They they have, you know, they all have that pattern to them. I feel like it might be the one kitty corner up. This one here? No, no, not that one. This one here? Oh, that goes to the crags. Right. Uh, go to the world map. I mean, the crags is kind of close to it. Uh, where does it's this... in between. Where does this green one go? Okay, uh, the, the crystal caves to the left. Is there one that goes like in the crystal here? Yeah. Oh, so then maybe this one is down there. Uh, oops, yeah. Sorry. That Those... one is down in the yeah. underwater city, the sunken shrine. Down there. We don't yeah. want to go there, but you do want to go to the Chris the Howling Grotto. So Or the Searing Crags. I think the Searing Crags warp is like on the opposite side of it. Oh right. This, I okay, think is so closer. let's see if this is on the right side. The correct history. side. The east the side. The right side of history. Her story. <sighs> Basement dollars. Who do you think was on the right side of her story? <laughs> uh, Eve. Okay, so we're... Of Adam and Eve fame. Where are we on this map? Down there. 
the very That's bottom. That's not too bad. Just go up and to the right, and you'll get there. Do we want this right arrow into the Quilch Room Marsh, or this up arrow into the Quilch Room Marsh? Does it matter? I am I would say it probably doesn't matter. Okay, Whatever so, one looks like it's easier to get to. So we're going right, up, up. and then a ton of up, and then a little left, and then yeah. a ton of up, and then all right. Cool. All right. Now we got to actually do it. Oh, okay. Peter and I were just talking about how this, this is what kind of doesn't make the game very fun for us. Mm-hmm. Go on. Is that it's a Metroidvania, but instead of you feeling more powerful <laughs> as you get into this part of the game, it stays a challenging platformer. So then you, like, hate your life when it's all said and done. Wow. <laughs> Peter is pushing all the buttons. Yes, I was. Tech. I mean, no one's surprised by that, but it is happening. Um, but yeah, like in in Metroid, for example, when you have to go back through s similar areas over and over and over again, eventually you get to a point where you're like, I've got all the cool weapons, I can run, I got better armor, and so you can like blast through stuff and you feel really powerful. Yeah, and it's part of the progression. That's what makes it so great. And in this one, you, go, you have to go through the same area again, and it's just as hard as the first time. Right. Because it's platform based, not. Oh, now, so close that if, time. If there was like a uh, an ability that made it so you could actually fly, like like an owl boy, they should have given it to us already, <sighs> and then we would have it, and then this wouldn't be so bad. How do I do this? You got to use your zip to the wall thing. Oh. Uh, hey, yep. There you go. Yeah, and all the things that you just said, we're. Uh, we haven't said in a while for us. I'm sure we just said it in the last but episode. But we did just say it in the last episode. Yeah, I think <laughs> you're right. And now here I am, weeks later in real life for us, trying to get used to the controls again. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay, we're going to go They like don't that, care. They like watch that. it. They watch it to watch a struggle. So this is perfect. Yeah, they're great. getting plenty of that. <laughs> Take that. So yeah, there's this thing that you do uh, that can really help in Ooh. making YouTube videos called batch recording. Yes. It's really, really great for production, like planning and all that stuff, but it's not great for rem Safe. remembering how to be good at games. Uh, that's Unless it's true. a game that you always do, like Breath of the Wild, for example. Right. But, and this one's complicated. I mean, it's not... It's not super intuitive. Yeah, it is kind of like the exact wrong game for fooling around like Buckets this. Buckets of fun. Buckets of fun. Thank goodness we got that save. Buckets of dumb. Dumb hole. I fell down a dumb hole. Don't. Don't do it. Don't do it. There you go. There um, you go. Do we want to time? Do we want a time? Well, I can mean? go through that time thing. I don't know. I don't I don't think so. I think you just want to keep going up. We'll find out, I suppose. Yeah, that's the best remember. way to find out, is to simply find out. Best way to find out is to find out. The best part Einstein. of finding out. Albert Einstein said that once. <laughs> the best way to find out is to find out. That's why... Every day I try to go the speed of light. <laughs> Just to that's find how out. I found out that you can't. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, that's not true. You cannot accelerate to the speed of light, but you could theoretically get there uh, if you just instantly were there. You okay, can't accelerate. Here we are. To it. We're here. There's a way to run on here, isn't there? Oh, I don't need to. I can do this. <laughs> At least we're not traversing really difficult stuff at a guess of where to go. Right, like we were doing for the first 40 50 episodes. episodes. <laughs> <laughs> it's 55. It's a lot of episodes. Yeah, so apparently you can't make playlists Aww. that include other channels' content. You're almost there. Just gotta go up and to the right. Yeah, I do gotta go up first, don't I? I'm almost where? To where the arrow is showing? Oop, okay. Ow. So, uh, GQ Gamer was asking if we would be able to merge the oh, two Oh, Skyward Sword. 
yeah. for Skyward Sword because the first 25 episodes exist somewhere else, and then and it ended up being another Zelda game that has 72 episodes in the playlist, which I know. is really funny. Well, I I mean we kind of was trying to make it happen there. I know, but still. The Still fact funny. that we could do it without it having to be too... Yeah, we didn't plan it from the beginning. It was just like, okay, we're almost done, and we're almost to 70. <laughs> right, so... How many we... side missions do you want to do? Just I... the right amount? Okay. I think we just did a couple, yeah. We didn't have to manufacture what? it all that much. Hmm. Definitely not going to die here. I don't think you will. I think I believe you that you definitely won't die here. Even with that bone turkey coming at you. What? Yo, uh, bone uh, turkey coming at you! <laughs> <laughs> All the way from Listen Philadelphia, to KBBT, Philadelphia bone Turkey Station, <laughs> Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. <laughs> okay, how do you run across stuff? ZR. Yep. Sure. <laughs> yes. <laughs> You'd tell I'm fed up when I just guess. Just do it. Don't just, even. Just go for it. Ah! Don't throw your hat at me. Gross! What a gross hat, dude. That, there's probably some fungus in that hat. There's okay, a fungus among save. this hat. And you healed up. Um, That's real nice. Okay, we're on our way. Close. Just keep going right. Yep. That's what I'm talking about. Right down we go. Down we go over. So Ow. Peter, when the messenger's done, what game do you want to play on the baseball let's play? Uh, something. I don't know. I think we should play something a little bit different. Yes, because well, we've been doing definitely that. Because didn't we have Cyber Shadow before this, it, it, or was it a different game before this? But Cyber Shadow was kind of recent. It's all in so much flux. I mean, Sea of Stars comes out in August. Yep, and that's, that's going to be a little far away. That is going to be far away, but that that's like but that's, that's different. That's JRPG, right? Is that um, what you just said? Or are we just am I just saying exactly what you're saying? Yes, Whoa! and I actually just said that too before you said. I said you're saying exactly what I'm saying. Oh, really? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been really awesome, though. I remember thinking those were so undodgeable, and then it just turns out that they're... Oops. I mean, so, like, yeah, I, I vote not a platformer. Ah! This isn't good. You're going to die from just pain. Pain. Well, instead of falling uh -oh. down a hole, you know? You got to use your shurikens. You're so close. I'm very close. Is there a way to... Just go down there get and... Get health? Well, shoot the, uh, that was one way to get health. You got some there. Now you just got to time this and just go for it. There you go. Whoop. Nope. Woo -hoo -hoo. There you go. I think Sometimes there's health in these things. It's true. I'm Sometimes very close to a save. I think, it wasn't I think actually good. all that hard. Nope. The tr They're going to throw okay. their hats. Well, he can't shoot through there. So that's good. Oh, you got some health. Yep. Okay, and then you can maybe... <sighs> Peter! What? <laughs> you want me to slow down? No, you really? just walked into the spikes instead of sh sh throwing a shuriken at him. I, well, I swung my sword, which undoes those spikes. I just pressed it a tiny bit late. Whoa. What is this? Goat lady. This is the monk who brought the butterfly matriarch to restore the grove centuries ago. Uh, that doesn't hey, mean thanks for the recap, because we don't remember this. Looks like she's been corrupted. Let me help her out. Corrupted? We had a boss battle here, and it was like a, a lady gone bad or something. Hey. Check out your pixels. <gasps> Gasp. She has horns? Or hey. is that like hair holders? She has COVID. <laughs> See? See? <laughs> then our guy does too, then. And just because oh, you're wearing oh, a mask doesn't right. mean you... And if you're wearing a mask, that doesn't mean you have it. <laughs> it just means you're afraid of it. Terrified. We're, your whole we're, life. We're so ignorant. <laughs> Primal fear. Take a deep breath, dear monk. I kid. I kid. I Don't thought be a offended female monk was a nun. Uh, what are you doing here? Is this the butterfly matriarch all right? No. <clears throat> uh, how, how long, long has, has it been? been in this marsh? What have I done? It's March. It's the eyes of Marsh. <laughs> Beware. Eyes of Marsh. I need to go see the prophet. Whoop! Whoa! Okay. Can well. we have that power, please? I'm sick and tired of having to the power platform of my way into vertical places. 
Okay. Dude, I want the power of a. We ascend. had to do that. Uh. Go see the prophet. So that. That was. That was that. We're not getting a musical note for it though. Right. This is what the guy told us to do. Do do do. I'm gonna try to find this in that walkthrough that you gave me. Um, I see can see where we are. This is an area I have not seen. I don't think we're here yet. I'm gonna go left because that save we were recently at had a door, and I could get back to the hub. Oh, yeah, that would be nice. Okay, I... heal the cursed monk. Done. We did that. Meet the cursed monk. Where? Okay. Once you've rescued the Queen of Quills, return to the Tower of Time HQ and speak with the Prophet. He'll direct you to the next thing. All right. Oh, the Prophet. Okay, that makes sense. We just gotta find the Prophet. Duh. <laughs> Easy. So I'll show you this. <laughs> Where the wind chills the bones, a brave monk has a simple but important final role to play. Chills the bones? That sounds like Glacial Peak to me. Yeah, I think we're going cold. Now we are going to have to do that next time in the basement. Uh, we are? Yes. Oh, okay. Uh, until next, until time, next time, basement dwellers, Doors we think that doors. you are more <laughs> cold to the bone than... Uh, th that guy who sang the song that was bad to the bone. What was that guy's name? B -b 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 bad <laughs> in, the in the basement. B -b -b -basement. Hey, that's it for today's video. If you haven't already and you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button and uh, maybe even consider subscribing to The Basement for more stuff like this. And as always, a huge thank you to our patrons and members and subscribers over on Twitch. You guys make The Basement happen, and uh, we couldn't do it without you guys. So thank you very much, and we'll see you guys next time in The Basement.